Welcome back to Wear Wigs with me. Today I am wearing Debutante by Gabor in the color Honey Pecan. So let's get started. Debutante is a brand new style by Gabor for October 2020. This is a heavily layered, textured, neck hugging style. It's classic, it's sophisticated, it's just a put together style. Debutante has a little bit of a bang that just sweeps right to the side. It has all these great layers that looks like quite a bit of hair, but it is so light on your head. I have this styled up away from my face, but this very easily can become a face framing style. And it's a mono top, so you could part this either direction see how that just curls right around your face and it hugs your neck it can be very sleek and low profile or do what I did. I actually just flipped my whole head upside down, got my hands in there, and just worked those layers. I mean, so easy, you guys. Also, this style is a super easy ear tucker. I mean, that's hardly any hair that I just put behind my ear, but it looks fantastic. This is a good one. This is easy. This is a workhorse wig. Once you get it the way you want it, you're not gonna keep fussing with it. It just moves with you. It doesn't get in your face. It's not fussy. This is a great style for somebody that has had short hair all summer with lots of layers, but maybe it's getting cooler where you are. And so you want something that kind of comes down over your neck a little bit, gives you a little warmth. This is a great style for that. The cap on Debutante is a typical Gabor cap. It has a beautiful temple to temple lace front. It has a full monofilament hand tied top. It has the comfortable velvet covered ear tabs with metal stays, and it has the velvet covered extended nape, Velcro adjusters, and then otherwise the sides and back are open wefts. Gabor caps are the sweatshirt of caps in the wig world. They are comfortable on day one. It isn't a cap that you have to get used to or break in, stretch out. Comfortable the first time you put it on. I have a 22 and a half inch circumference head. Very comfortable, very stretchy, very light, and it's open wefts, so it's breathable in all these layers. This is a very comfortable, cool cap. The measurements on Debutante. The front and sides are listed at four and a half inches. The back and the nape is listed at five and a half inches. And then the crown is listed at six and a half inches. And the weight of Debutante is 3.2 ounces. It is such a light style. Let's talk about the hair fibers and the permatease. The hair fibers are typical Gabor hair fibers. They run on the dry side, and I would say they're medium and denier. Not too fine, not too heavy. I think they move very naturally.
but they have enough weight to keep their style. You can get the, the flippy look, or if you wanted to comb this one down, you could get a very kind of low profile, sleek look with it. I, I feel like Gabor, all Gabor hair fibers are right in the middle of weight and denier. Very natural, very, very comfortable to style, very easy to manipulate and get the desired style that you're after. The Permatease, there is Permatease and it's kind of all over where you would expect it to be, not on top, but in the sides and in the back. It's not super heavy anywhere. Uh, it's just kind of a light covering. It's also not Permatease that you're gonna get in there and it's gonna give you a ton of volume. I will say I have worked with this wig a lot to try different styles and I do think that it is enough Permatease that when I get in there and I work up some volume, I feel like the Permatease helps it stay there. The color I chose is Honey Pecan. This is very much a brunette with golden highlights. And this brunette, I feel like it looks different on a lot of different people. On me, I feel like it's an ashy brunette with the golden highlights. In fact, the first time that I put it on, I kind of thought it looked gray on me, but it's not gray. It is a brunette with golden highlights. It's very pretty, it's a very natural color. The way they've done the highlighting, it is a very natural light brown with golden highlights color. It's very pretty. Okay, so I've talked about the cap and the color and the measurements and the permatease and the hair fibers. My overall thoughts about debutante is that this is a workhorse wig. This is a wig that once you get it in the style that you like it, it's not gonna go anywhere. I did add a little bit of John Renault holding spray. I forgot about that. Let me tell you what I did to get it like this. When it comes to you, it's going to be very flat. So I gave it a really good shake. Now, of course, you can only do this if you know you're gonna keep the wig, but I gave it a really good shake, fluffed up those hair fibers, loosened them up away from the cap, and then I put it on my head. And it still wanted to kind of fall flat again. So I turned my head upside down, sprayed it with John Renault holding spray, and then got my hands in there and really just fluffed it up and worked those hair fibers, giving it some volume, letting it flip all around. And I love it. I love all the layers and the texture, and especially with this color, with those highlights. My favorite Gabor color is chocolate caramel, and I think this would be beautiful in chocolate caramel. With all the different colors that chocolate caramel has, I just know that that will be gorgeous. But it's very pretty in, in honey pecan as well. I think debutante is going to fit a lot of different face shapes and sizes. I think it is a well done style. Okay, so this has been Debutante by Gabor in the color Honey Pecan. Thank you to Hair You Wear for sending me this brand new piece for October 2020 to put on my channel. If you haven't already, hit that subscribe button, give it a thumbs up, and do a little chit chat down in the comments. I can't wait to hear what you guys think about Debutante.